Hi there, my name is Samuel and today clearly I will be forgetting something because I literally forgot these two elements and I'm sorry that I have forgot that. So in the review, you will see that those are like not there. And yet I've literally packed everything away, like no light, that's why it isn't the best light. I'm not even sitting um, down at this point in time. Yeah, that's why I just thought I'd quickly explain those pieces and that is what it looks like. It doesn't really change anything. So yeah, again, apologies that I forgot about that. And um, yeah, so uh, let's cut back to the footage. This video is actually going up when it is being recorded. So it is Friday the 8th of January, 2021. And I want to say, um, so I will do a proper video about this Sunday, but I will have Ninjago week next week. I've just done a lot of back filming. Originally, I was going to squeeze this in somewhere, but I've already got... 14, yes, about 14 videos minimum coming out next week. So I thought, you know what, I will add this one for today. And then, yeah, so that'll be Sunday. So the next few videos will be a bit shorter because I've got, it's going to be hectic next week as it's near Joe's 10th anniversary. So I'm just doing a bit of an announcement now. And I will say in the Morris video, which I think I'll do the uh, Ninja Ambush from 2015 with Kai and the Anaconda Warrior. I think that one, I'll quit, that'll be a nice quick one I can do for tomorrow. But then, yeah, I will sort of announce it. So, yeah, this is the one I'll be taking a look at today, which this is the 850445, as I said, the Ninja uh, Ninjago character card train, which is really weird. It had 88 pieces and one minifigure, and then this costs, um, how much? It was £12.99p, so £13.15. I remember finding this in one of the bargain bins in Lego, like the clearance bins. I just remember finding it. I think I found it for, like, six or seven pounds i don't know i just really remember getting it which is really cool so you can see that it has to shine so let's take a look at the minifigure of rattler i believe yes it is rattler and then let's take a look at the um, build itself so here you can see rattler which is the only minifigure of this set there you can see he's printing which is pretty awesome and his headdress does have printing if we remove that here there you can see that which is pretty nice i like the fact that they've done that and there you can see his face which honestly i think this is just a, such a well done minifigure i really like the snakes i really can't wait to can start like collecting going back getting all of the older stuff but there you can see the face print which honestly i really like the look of it it's got so many like the black and the blue is such a contrast that like, it's really hard to see see them so yeah you can just about see them but yeah that is basically it for rattler i think this is a really awesome minifigure and yeah, now let's take a look at the build itself. So taking a look at the build itself, you can see it's just this nice little shrine with the Vera, uh, not the Venomari, the Hypno Brain, sorry, the Staff Lamp, which honestly is really cool. I just done um, this one, so that's why I had Venomari on the brain. But yeah, there you can see this, which honestly, I think this is a really nice little build. And it's such a weird one. Like I looked, it's worth like, what was it, like 20, 20 something pounds? It's really weird why it's got so rare. Like I don't exactly know the story behind it, why it's so rare, but um, yeah, it's good. how do I find it on clearance? Save something to get when I'm like collecting all the sets. But taking a look at the bottom, you can see we have some masonry brick, some dark tan, some dark grain, just your usual parts. You can see the hypnobri element there, which is cool. You've got the snake ring, which is really nice, and then we got the back card, which is really cool. Which there are lots of cards. I've got to look for some of the others for the other sets. But there you can see the head print, which I think is really nice. And actually, I can give you a better look at that, which I really like the look of that. I love the way it just connects around the sides. Lego, I don't think would ever get that closest day and age which is a sadly a uh, thing to say but yeah there you can see that which is cool the uh, hypno bryant staff and then if you actually want to look at the rattler's card you can see it's one of the like you can see them changing you can see rattler moves there to there which is really cool and yeah i really like these cards and it's cool to sort of see them return on the packaging of the um battle sets which i will have a review when that comes out and i don't know does this look faded don't think so so ninjago.com from 20 uh what uh this is the fourth wave uh so i think it's 20 13 i want to say is it 2013 i'm having a look yeah no sorry 2012 but then you can see that which is cool and it's funny it says fire lightning earth and ice i don't exactly get how it's got power maybe it's resistance but yeah that's basically it. and there you can see the shrine without it which honestly it looks a bit um bare you gotta admit it doesn't look the best without it sliding that back in you can see we have some ooze coming out of the top i guess this is a part of the area when they are, are resurrecting uh what do you call him the great devourer and yeah that's basically it for this set which honestly it's really cool i really like this set it's just a nice a little neat set doesn't make sense not really canon but still i like the look of it so there we have it i hope you did enjoy this um review and yeah again it's a bit of a shorter one but i've got a lot i've been filming i've got to get a lot to be filmed so yeah thank you all for watching this video stay tuned for next week i will have a playlist for ninjago so once the first video goes live which will be this one that's the first one that's going live um so yeah i hope you did enjoy this video leave a like a comment and subscribe and until tomorrow's video i'll see you there bye for now